hello guys in android you know we can use this volley library to do a string request to a server now what if we want to return this response when we are called into this function for example if we have a, a string here in the top and uh, after reading the response if we say name is equal to response and after everything if we say uh, return name that won't work for example uh, here let me undo my all the code so show you what will happen here you can see the name is visible so without this step so so you okay now here I'm going to return name that won't work that won't work because uh, this data will uh, receive asynchronously okay now you can see the name is not visible so the solution will be when you create your class you are going to create a public interface inside the class so you can uh, use whatever callback name here so I can say uh, doctor name callback so you can use whatever callback name for example my callback now inside this I am going to have two things first one void on success and this will parameterize with a string response okay now the next one is on error void on error so this will take a string error okay now after that when you are going to uh, call to your string request function for for example here I have this function and inside that uh, here inside this method I have all the codes that uh, make the request to the server and read data okay so what I will do when I am calling to that function here here doctor and I am passing in some identifier instead that I am going to uh, just call to that function but that function also should be parameterized with uh, this callback type for example doctor name callback okay that is my this uh, callback interface name so I'm going to define the name as callback now inside this when we read this uh, on response if this success we can say callback uh, dot on success and then inside this we can pass in our response now if these are wrong we can uh, return the name uh, error for example callback callback dot on error error uh, here response again it's fine so I'm going to do that here in the on error response here I'm going to return error uh, get message okay now here when we are calling to that method I'm going to read uh, firstly pass in required data to that method to I uh, fetch data from the uh, server actually that's uh, not relevant to your code the only thing that we had to pass in here is the callback that means I will say new doctor name callback otherwise your uh, callback name there so new your callback name so it will create this callback so in this on success we can go ahead and assess this response for example I can uh, change my text 
text view dot set text response now uh, I think the problem with my project so I'm going to clean it and start again Now you can see it is working. Thank you very much. If you like this video, please like and subscribe.